what's up you guys it's my woman two times back with another video in today's video we're doing diy tooth gems and the reason why i'm calling them diy is because i'm literally diying this i have no kit i have no tooth gem kit i'm doing this with the tools that i have at home so therefore this is not a tutorial and i'm not saying that this is how you do them this is just how i've been doing them so i'm gonna show you guys how i do it if you guys would like to do them i mean by all means go ahead so i have some started already um as you guys can see they look good so i'm gonna finish off where i left off in this video i'm gonna show you guys what i'm using and then we're just gonna get into finishing the tooth gems let's make sure these don't fall out so i got these tooth gems from amazon and i forgot to type in swarovski crystals because that's the ones that i wanted these came up i just typed in nail gems i like these ones because they're they're not iridescent iridescent no i don't think they're iridescent but I just like them. They're really, really cute. And they come in all types of sizes as well. So that's why I picked these ones out. I'm going to link them in the description box below just in case you guys want to get the same ones that I got. And then this is the reason why I call it DIY. The adhesive that I'm using is nail glue. And this is KDS Products Nail Glue. This is what it looks like. They actually came with these press-ons that I got. I got these from Riante Nails on Instagram. I'm going to link her info down in the description box below just in case you want to copy you guys some nails. I actually broke this one the other day and I still have the gummy bear so I'm going to glue it on and just try to get this fixed at a nail salon because they're just so fucking cute. I love them. Ignore this one. Um, yeah, just ignore that. <laughs> oh yeah. And then the last tool that I'm going to be using is these tweezers just so I could pick up the nail gems and place them on my tooth. I have my gems on my vanity. I'm just going to pick one up. You're also gonna need some type of like surface to put the nail glue on so you could just dip it into the nail glue and place it on your tooth. So I'm using like an old photo. I don't know if you guys can see it and I put the nail glue on top. I'm gonna dip it in the glue, let it dry a little bit. I'm gonna finish the whole bottom row of my two front teeth and then I'm gonna show you guys what they look like in the end. Oh, and also you're gonna need cotton swabs to clean your teeth off. Clean your teeth off before applying the gem so it's on a dry surface. I don't have cotton swabs because I ran out, so I'm using tissue paper and it works, it does the job. So therefore, yeah, take your cotton swab or your tissue paper and just wipe off your teeth and then place the gem. Uh, it's dry already, fuck. Let's try this again. Take the gem, dip it in your glue, dry your tooth off and then place the gem. This is so annoying. You know, so the problem that I have is when I go to dip the tooth gem into the glue, the glue gets stuck on the tweezers and then it's hard for the gem to come off. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna take the nail glue and I'm gonna just place the dots on my tooth and then just apply the tooth gems because it'll just be way easier. And it's giving me a hard time. I don't want this video to be too long. I'm gonna take some more tissue paper, wipe my tooth off. Oh my god. I'm drawing. Oh my god. This is so annoying. <sighs> Okay, this is what they're looking like. Uh, I'm gonna keep going. <laughs> so I got the bottom row done already. This is what it's looking like. And now I'm gonna just keep going around. Okay, I'm back. I'm gonna speed up the process, so just enjoy. Oh my God. Let me focus it up. Hopefully you guys can see. Excuse the glue right here. I got glue on my lip, but this is what they're looking like so far. I'm just gonna keep on going on to this tooth and my canines, and then I'll show you guys the results. Now I'm gonna go on with slightly bigger gems. I'm gonna go on with number four right here. Ah, fuck, see, some of them flew out. Well, if you get the same gems that I got, I'm gonna go on with number four, which is slightly bigger. And I'm just gonna fill my these right here on 
in two. I'm gonna fill them up and then I'm gonna show you guys what they look like after I'm done because it's just taking up mad time having you guys just watch me put them on. So I'm just gonna come back once the process is done. <laughs> So this is how they look now. I just got done doing this tooth and now I'm going to continue to finish this tooth. Okay, so I got them all on there. This is how they look. I need to brush them because the nail glue kind of dried and it looks a mess. But I'm going to brush my teeth and then I'll be right back. All right, guys. So I might look a little weird because I had to brush my teeth and rinse my mouth out. So like the bottom half of my makeup kind of came off like on my chin. But these are the finished tooth gems. Ah, I love them. They're so cute. I just added big ones on my canines because I didn't feel like going through that whole process of filling up the whole shit. I just want to put this out there. Don't do this unless you want to because when I was getting tired of trying to like glue the gems onto my teeth, I literally ended up just like taking the glue and just putting it all over my tooth and gluing the gems on like that. And I swallowed a, a little bit of nail glue and it was disgusting and it burned. So don't do this unless you want to. I know this video was pretty short because I'm literally just speeding up the process while I put the two gems on because there's literally no need for you guys to just sit there and watch me put them on. Even though it's like a tooth gem DIY type of video, it was just taking up too much time. So I'm gonna put it in clips. So yeah, if you guys try this out, make sure you DM me pictures on my Instagram. I wanna see how they come out. And if you do want to get a kit, get the kit and do it with the kit. I hope you guys liked it. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll be back with another video next week. And yeah, be out of here.